I want to talk today about the Bhagavad Gita. Where, uh, I know it's a mouthful. Bhagavad Gita means the song of God. It's been called the Hindu Bible. They say that Gandhi freed India using the principles in this book. And I know that when we talk about leadership, you get into really deep stuff. You get into stuff about uh, what is the nature of courage, the nature of conflict, the nature of human existence. And this book is definitely a scripture. You can see I have like four translations here that I just have in my own library. Definitely a scripture on the level with the Bible, the Koran, the writings of the Buddha, um, Lao Tzu, Confucius, anything at, at that great level. And like all great depth studies and, and scriptures, it has a very simple concept, the Bhagavad Gita. The story is of the great warrior Arjuna on the eve of a great battle. He's with his chariot, in his chariot, and he looks across at the army on the other side, and he recognizes kinsmen and teachers and people that he know, that he knows. And he turns to his charioteer and he's, he becomes very upset and he says, drive my chariot out between the two armies and stop. And so his charioteer does that. And at that point, Krishna lays down his immortal, I mean, Arjuna lays down his immortal bow, Gandiva, and refuses to fight. And he says, he looks across at the enemy and he sees people he knows and loves. And he says, nothing good is going to come of this. I see no, nothing good that's going to come out of killing these people. And of course, and he's saying this to his charioteer. Now it turns out that his charioteer is Krishna, i.e. God in human form. And at that point, Krishna reads Arjuna the riot act, and he begins a kind of a long um, treatise of self-instruction in the spiritual life and the nature of reality. And so that is the whole concept of the Bhagavad Gita. I'm going to talk for another, at least another three of these episodes about it because it's so deep and so interesting. But uh, this is, uh, again, a, a book I've read over and over and over. The Bhagavad Gita, the Hindu Bible.